Yo, what is up guys? It's Rebra and I'm back with another manga shopping vlog. We're gonna go check out a couple places today. We're gonna stop by Mini Akihibara and on the way home, we're gonna check out Kinokuni and see what they got in stock. But before all that, I just wanna give a quick Discord server update. We just hit 100 members and are doing a little giveaway to celebrate it. It ends July 15th, so check that out if you haven't already and enter. We're gonna continue to do milestone giveaways, but I plan to do monthly giveaways as well, whether it's Nitro or more gift cards, just to keep things fun and interesting. Anyways, let's get to the video. So first off, we're going to go hit up a little shop called Mini Akihibara. This is a shop ran by one man named Aki, who runs it through his Facebook group out of his garage. He's got an awesome selection of anything we've related, whether it's video games, figures, manga, you name it. There's a link in the description. You can go ahead and check that out if you're into this stuff. I'm not being paid to say this. I'm just a fan. Just showing my support. But yeah, I'm heading over there to go pick up some Oh My Goddess Omnibuses that he reserved for me. The price was fantastic, I couldn't pass it up. So I'm excited to go pick those up and finally check out the shop. So as you can see, he has a ton of stuff here. Personally, I'm not into toys, but still, I can appreciate any type of collectible, and this is an amazing selection. So we finally get to the manga section here, which he's got a few good things in here. You know, I don't end up picking anything up. I'm pretty much happy with getting the Oh My Goddess Omnibuses, which he already handed to me at that stage. But looking back now, I probably should have picked up that prison school volume. 10 bucks is pretty cheap in my opinion. And the volume was in really good condition. I mean, everything that was in there was in really, really nice condition, including the omnibuses that I ended up buying from them. He's got quite a bit of DVDs. Honestly, personally, I would prefer to collect Blu-rays, but looking at my favorite series, even in DVD form, like Love Hina and Full Metal Panic, makes me <laughs> want it anyways, but I don't pick any DVDs up right now. It's still fun to browse through what he's got. 
So he actually has a collector's edition for the Oh My Goddess Dreamcast game, which is awesome. He tried showing it to me, but he wasn't able to get the game out of the slip box, I guess because the seal was getting caught with the box, which was kind of funny, but scary at the same time. I didn't want him to ruin it or anything, but I, I told him to hold on to it for me because after he showed me the pic, it looked, it looked really awesome. Nice. Oh, okay. So it's like getting. So as you can see, it comes with like a backpack and these like little figures and stuff. It's just, it's just so cool in my opinion. Yeah, I had been following your your Facebook for a while now, and I was like, man, when am I gonna go here? Like, uh, Wea Bra. So like Wea and then Bra. I just barely started a few months ago, but the channel has been growing pretty fast though. Uh, uh, w e e b r. Yeah. It's kind of embarrassing, but <laughs> I just barely started it, but. But it's mostly primarily uh, manga stuff, but.
I'm super happy about the purchase. He gave me a great deal on the omnibuses. He even threw in a freebie, a little DVD and some stickers, which was awesome. You know, I definitely recommend checking him out. He's got great prices, a great selection, and he's willing to negotiate with you as well. He's super chill. Definitely recommend it. So on the way back home, we're gonna stop by Kino Kunia. We've already been here in a previous shopping vlog, but I decided why not show you guys a little bit more in depth what they have. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys their entire Japanese selection as well as their manga selection and take a closer look at some of the art books by flipping through a few of them. I won't be talking very much, so just sit back and enjoy the shopping.
I end up just picking up volume one of Mashal. I recently read the first chapter and thought it was extremely hilarious. And the first volume for it just recently got released apparently, so had to pick that up. So that is pretty much it for this shopping vlog video, guys. Thanks for watching. I have the second part to the Mal and Annie List reactions coming up. Just need to record it and get it uploaded. And I'm still kind of working out the kinks on the leather hardcover Attack on Titan project. And don't forget to check out that Discord server giveaway. Anyways, guys, thanks again. I'll see you guys next time.